All right, in this video, we are going to talk about the Sources tab. So I'm going to Command Option I, which is my favorite way to open up DevTools. And it's already on Sources here. So the Sources tab is pretty interesting. It, from the sound of it, it's where you go to look at each of the sources. You can look at each of the public documents that the page has loaded, and that's true. But when you're going to use it is when you're really trying to debug something. The bigger your program gets, the harder it is to find what's broken. If something stops working, that can be a huge time sucker. But the Sources tab is an awesome tool for helping with just that. So what we're going to do here is we can set something called breakpoints. Looks like there's already some set up. I was messing around on here a little bit earlier. So I'll say um, I want line 18. I just clicked it over here and now it's over here. When I refresh the page, it's going to stop at each of these places. It says it's paused. And when that happens, I can go to any of these other tabs and see exactly what's going on. That's a big deal because it allows you to really go step by step in your code and look at the big picture at a very specific moment in your code's run. You can set your breakpoints based on a JavaScript event, <clears throat> excuse me, based on a specific line of code, based on something to do with the DOM and manipulating that, which we'll get to in other videos. It is a really versatile tool. And what I want you to remember about the Sources tab is it is really helpful in debugging your code. 